day, human Latios Slates. This is Latios Azure. I'm welcoming another Pokemon Showdown UU battle from before Bikini was banned to BL. Now, my opponent evolved Raichu, goes for Tornadus to go for a substitute, but I'm able to just Rock Blast to get right down through the substitute. It's not going to quite take it down, but it's going to take it down to a lot, a nice, decent amount of health. So, it's going to be able to go for a Toxic, which is going to do, which is going to be annoying, but I am able to Tail Slap the Tornadus, um, out of the battle. So, unfortunately, Chinchino is Toxic, though. So, I'm able to go for a Tail Slap on the Umbreon. It's going to do about half damage, but it doesn't matter because he's going to start cursing, so I figure he's probably going to try to Toxic Stall me, so I end up switching out Chinchino. Just so I could just go into um, Skeptile, who I figure is a special attacker. So at that point, I figure I'd just go for a Focus Blast, except he's going to go for a Sucker Punch, which is really going to hurt because he's a um, plus two attack. However, I figure he's going to go for another Sucker Punch, so I actually just Toxic him instead. Since for this way, I can actually just take him down little by little. However, I know that Skeptile is going to get Toxic as well from the Synchronize, but not much I can do. At least his Umbreon now has its turns count. Um, well being counted down. So I go into Rotom just to go for a little wisp. I know he's going to he's already poisoned, he's not gonna do anything, but he ends up taunting me. I figure he's gonna go for a sucker punch. This plan figure he knows he's gonna go for a sucker punch because I'm taunted, so I actually switch into Porygon 2. So I can cleanly get the switch into Porygon 2 and his Umbreon will go down. So he sends out his Aggron, he's gonna go for an Autotomize, which is gonna double his speed and lighten him, but I'm able to just go for a Shadow Ball, which is neutral. So I figured the two would KO. He misses the head smash, which is huge because next he goes into his Cloister, which he's going to Shell Smash. But once he, he Shell Smashes, he's going to be able to hit Nice Ghost Spear, because I know he's going to be Sashed. I go for a Tri-Attack and just hope for some kind of hacks. I don't get any. But he got, he, so he lands the Icicle Spear, but somehow Porygon 2 manages to survive the Icicle Spear. Had that Head Smash hit, Porygon 2 would have been, do would have been done. So he goes into his Chandelure next. I'm able to just recover. I figure I can just get a clean switch into Victini, he's probably going to go for an overheat, which he does, which is going to lower his special attack, which at that point, I just go for a Shadow Ball, and he's just going to actually, weirdly enough, go for a Memento, which is going to lower Victini, well, have Victini's attack and special attack, but sacrifice his Chandelure. So at that point, I just switch out from, um, from well, for his Curum into Rotom Mo, and I notice he's Life Orb, so the Stone is going to do a lot of damage, so I figure I can just sacrifice off Rotom Mo, and just get a switch, a clean switch into Chinchino, who has a super effective Rock Blast on it. But, this Rock Blast doesn't quite do enough to take down Kyurem. However, it's a 10% health, so I was able to go for an Iron Head, get a Crit, take down Chino, but the Life Orb damage will take down Kyurem and win me the game. So, thank you for watching. As always, like, comment, and subscribe. Goodbye.